Let's watch. Let's see what has happened. Smaller, oh my goodness! But, what oh. is happening? Hello my friends and welcome back to PlayStation Underground. On today's show we are playing Monster Hunter World, which is coming to PS4 on January 26th. I am joined by Kristen, my co-host. Hello. Hello. And we have a special guest, Yuri from Capcom, who is our humble guide and hunter. Hello, sir. <laughs> hello, hello. Welcome to the program. Tell us, uh, we are gonna, we're going to go on a hunt today. Yes. Uh, yeah, so today we are going into one of the areas of the game uh, called the Rotten Vale. Ooh. So uh, this is, uh, yeah, the, the oh name God. should be an indication of what you should see here. But it's actually uh, quite interesting, you know, fits quite well with the, with the world the the new world there it sits right under the another area of the game call, called the coral highlands okay so we'll see some interesting are we just gonna sail right past the glorious feast <laughs> you just had that was the most delicious looking thing i've ever seen you can't hunt on an empty stomach no so, you certainly yeah. can't <laughs> no good hunter goes on an empty stomach so yeah i think uh you know we Got to snarf it down as fast as it can because, uh, <laughs> you know, there's monsters to be hunted. So. Absolutely. <laughs> and and uh, today what, what you guys wanted to come and show us is sort of the classic Monster Hunter loop, which is embark out into the wilds, hunt a monster, bring it down, and then return to the town to craft yeah. uh, from those components, correct? Correct. So today we're going to be tracking down and hunting the Radovan, the a, uh, one of the denizens of the Rotten Vale, um, and then uh, hopefully... We'll get some get enough parts to make some armor, some weapons, Got something it. to show you guys. Um, the Rotten Vale doesn't sound like a, like a nice place to live, right? I wouldn't want to set up shop there. <coughs> <laughs> it looks uh, very homey. It's right? I don't, I don't <laughs> super know what cozy, you mean. super cozy. <laughs> if you're the scavenger type, and you know, if you like eating carcasses of other dead animals <laughs> that just fall from the sky, Which Ryan doesn't loves sound, doesn't to sound do. Doesn't sound vegetarian oh, to me. Oh my god! All right. <laughs> You were not kidding. <laughs> right on cue. Uh, yeah, this is, like I said, oh, look, look at those scavenger guys down there. Oh, my God. Uh, so Th this uh, Everything I've seen of Monster Hunter World so far is tremendous. It's huge in scale. Uh, of course, the classic like multi-weapon gameplay, crafting systems, all that is here. But I feel like this entry in the series is, again, just on a much bigger scale than we've seen in the past. Is that fair to say? Yes, yes. Uh, you know the we, the team has developed. You know the the title of the game is Monster Hunter World, and there is a huge emphasis on building the entire world and the ecosystem. So, uh, yeah, that that's a big part of it. And you know you you'll see it in the gameplay uh, here today. But especially if you play it at home, the more you play, the more you'll see this world. F you know, just bloom and, and open to you know right before your eyes, like as as you discover things and how monsters interact and uh, yeah. Well, tell us a little bit about so Sam, Monster Hunter noob extraordinaire. <laughs> what am What am I seeing right now? You're we're, we're tracking the your the monster in question, but kind of walk me through not only the UI but how you guys how you're you know using your tracking as well. Yeah, so I'm using the, uh, the a new thing here called the scout fly. Uh, it's the the green trail there. Uh, these are living insects, uh, living organism that you know that will track down the scent of the monster. Um, and we'll, uh, we you know, the, the more you collect of these, these clues, they'll guide you to where the monster might be. So they're taking me on a little bit of a diversion here. Actually, I, I went so on you my could own potentially <laughs> you could potentially find clues for not the monster that you're hunting. Correct. Yeah. Ooh. Right now I'm tracking Tricky the... Tricky business. <laughs> yeah. I'm tracking the Radabon and I'm picking up things. Uh, looks like I, I maxed out the tracking for this quest, so... So now it's going to lead you directly to it. You found enough clues. Yes. Got I, I, I got a little distracted trying to explain what, <laughs> what was happening. but <laughs> No distractions allowed. <laughs> you have to be solely dedicated to your quest. Yeah. So this should take me right to it. But, yeah, as you said, there are other monsters in the map. And uh, you can... You know, you can run into them even without them, you know, even without tracking them. Ooh, so oh, goodness. Oh. Watch out. We have found him. Yep. There he is. Oh, this is it. Yeah, so... This is our spiny monster <laughs> in question. <laughs> yeah. And now our, our hunt truly begins. <laughs> yeah. And now Get the back. hunt <laughs> truly begins. He yeah. hasn't spotted me yet, so it's still running around. Oh, I see. Uh, He's just doing his thing. So what, what weapon have it's, you chosen here? Do you have a strategy going into this hunt? Oh, gosh. Yes. Oh, still it is me. a lot bigger but in person yeah. than... Uh, Let's get his attention here. 
Hi. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> He's not happy about Oh, look at his oh little face. <laughs> yeah. That is funny. His face is like tucked in there. Uh, yeah, tell us about our lo as As you get into the hardest part of the quest, tell us about your loadout, Yuri. Yeah, this well, is let's your trial and tribulation. Oh, oh boy. <laughs> Trying to run away a bit, <laughs> run, run but away. the uh, yeah the the loadout that I have here you um, you'll see I have a long sword. Uh, this is a fast, uh, long reaching, close, long reaching melee weapons, mm -hmm. one of them. And uh, the armor that I have right now is the uh, samurai set from the, uh, the actually the digital deluxe uh, edition here. Whoa. And uh, yeah, it, it's actually a layered set that just covers for a visual effect. Uh, yeah, I have another armor set underneath that should give me uh, some extra protection. Which you, some which of these. I, it you seems will need. like you will need, yes. Yeah. <laughs> With this weapon, I can't block, so I either have to what? dodge. Okay. Yep. So you I go all in on offense when you <laughs> equip this weapon type. Uh, I see. Yeah, it's it's fast, so it uh, at least has got some, uh, you know. You're able it to tuck and roll me. pretty quickly yeah. and get out of his way. Tuck and roll. <laughs> like out of a moving car, just tuck and roll. Just whoop. Yeah. Monsters are a chomping. So y you also have a buddy here helping you out. So Yeah. I have a Palico. It's a feline companion right there. Named Tango. Uh, I named him Tango. <laughs> you can create your Palico as you create your character in the game. Awesome. So... Um, does Tango partake in the giant feast that you started the mission with? Uh, I believe so. He was there, yeah. He yeah. was right behind him. Yeah. Chomping Good. away. Just chomping away? <laughs> All right. Uh, Good. Yeah. So parts broken. So is is there a, a strategy here to try to break him down bit by bit? Yeah. Um, so Radabon, uh, you know, one of the scavengers there of the Rotten Vale, uh, he will... Oh. Yeah. Oh. So he will cover himself in uh, bones, right? Mm -hmm. And these are bones from other monsters. Those what? are not. Those They're are not, not his? his. Nope. <laughs> I thought they were oh spines from gosh, his body. I know. Yeah. What a cool design. Yeah. Oh, he's doing these earthquake attacks. Oh, Keep me oh. at bay. So love the character animation, by yeah. the way. First of all, the run animation in Monster Hunter needs to just deserve an award right now. <laughs> Let's just issue that. Love it. Could could watch the hunter run all day. So emphatic. So the. The part where you're asking about, you know, strategy of breaking parts, yeah, the Radabon has, like, this extra armor that he gets uh, from, you know, other monsters. From other monsters. So what we want to do is, like, you know, maybe target those parts to break them off and reveal weaker spots that we can hit. Uh, Got it. But in the meantime, you know, like, right now my, my weapon uh, often bounces from, you know, from the harder parts, right? So right. you have to be careful what are you hitting when. I see. Um, I think oh. one of the most. Oh, oh, sorry. Go ahead, Yuri. Oh. Were you gonna say something? Oh no, no. Go ahead. You're, just, <laughs> you're like, no. Go ahead. I'm just dodging a uh, giant lethal <laughs> bone monster. The thing that I find most interesting about Monster Hunter, besides the feast that you ate, is <laughs> that it seems like almost every monster that you fight in this game is essentially like going up against a boss fight with its own stages, its own patterns to learn, yep. its own strategies. You have to accommodate your loadout. You have to think about, you know, how you approach a battle. Do you want to go in initially with a stealth approach? Do you want to go, go in a different guns way? Guns blazing. Guns blazing. Yeah. Cats blazing. <laughs> so I, I just, I love that about it. And it seems like it creates a, a huge and extraordinary sense of Whoa. depth. Hello. Yeah, this another strategy you can do is you can try to land a jump attack and mount the monster. Oh, very cool. Uh, this will, you know, get you a little bit of breathing room. I can I can now talk a little bit. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but which which the players will not have to do when they're actually at home playing themselves. They're not being filmed. Yeah, they're not being unless recorded. they're streaming. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, their strategy and the, the strategy doesn't uh, doesn't change to just how. Um, how you want to approach a monster from the monster side. It also changes from the hunter side. Right now, I have a long sword, so I, I do cutting damage. I can do things like try to sever his tail off. Mm -hmm. uh, if I'm wearing, a ha if I'm wielding a hammer, I would focus more on his head to do like stun damage and, and knock him out for a couple of seconds. You know, and then right. you know that contributes to you know it, it'll either give you a couple of seconds to to breathe Whoa. and heal. Or give your teammates a chance to do a bigger attack. So, yeah. Oh, oh, there you go. 
There, there it is. Another broken part. And yeah, that it should be noted. You're you're fighting this monster solo, but Monster Hunter World is a <laughs> cooperative game. Yes. Yep. See, what I really love about what I've seen from Monster Hunter is that oh. for a second there, he was running away. The tail just I, came off. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> I I love that they're fully allowed to engage in the environment. You know, once yeah. you start that boss battle, it's not like you're sequestered to a, to a certain area. They can totally try to run away from you. Uh, you could lose track of them and have to re-hunt them. Um, which I think is great. And another monster could just wander in here at any moment. Yeah. And complicate oh. things. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's going to show you something else up there. The Radabon seems here like it's losing a bit of its balance. And, uh, uh, oh. Ooh. Oh, what is happening? I ran into that. Oh. This is sleep gas. Oh, wow. <laughs> How many <laughs> Your poor little Palico <laughs> is oh. napping. <laughs> Energy drink. Get out of there, Tango. It. I got it. Yeah. Oh, there it Use is. Use that energy drink. So luckily I had that from the supply. Uh, make sure to always grab supplies from supply box mm -hmm. hunters. It's uh, Always. Oh. oh, right to the yeah. jaw. <laughs> but what I'd show you here, uh, we actually have uh, tracks from another monster. Oh, hang on. It'll <laughs> pop up. Focus, focus on not dying. I think yep. that should be your primary focus. Yeah, I'm healing. Oh, Tango, uh, me ouch. <laughs> yeah, so see here. Oh. <laughs> Anyways, going to avoid that for now. Yeah, why don't you just run? I can. <laughs> Kristen, I, I know you're not like a super hardcore Monster Hunter person, right? I, I haven't played previous games, but I, I was able to uh, test out some multiplayer a couple months ago, and it was a really exciting experience. I have been so hyped on this game ever since I saw the first trailer. Um, and I'm just, I'm really excited that it's coming to console. Yeah. Is this going to be one that you might actually try and jump into? Oh, absolutely. I'm, I'm going to be there opening I'm thinking, day. I'm thinking the same thing, but who has the time? Who has the time? <laughs> who has the time? Well, I guess the, the good thing. You at home has the time. <laughs> Available January 26th <laughs> on PS4. That's not the end of the show. I'm just, just throwing oh that out there. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. But yeah, so for, for people who are diving in who, who've never played Monster Hunter World before, um, could you tell us a little bit about what the, the campaign plot is for this game? Because you absolutely could just do multiplayer and just be hunting until, you know, the sun comes up. Hunt but until dawn. Hunt until dawn. But is there uh, a centralized plot? Yeah, there's a story. Uh, we, you arrive at the, you know, you're part of the fifth fleet from uh, working for the research commission and you go into this new world. Oof. So it's a new yeah. new island, uh, sorry, a new land that, uh, you know, With has roly been poly spike monsters. <laughs> <on>. <laughs> yeah. Oh. A nice safe environment for settlement. Uh, another monster showed up here. <gasps> oh, oh, hello. My goodness. Let's watch, let's see what has happened. Smaller, oh my goodness, but what oh. is happening? So yeah. this w this just kind of happens, right? Yeah. Is this? Oh gosh! Oh. Hello. <laughs> As you run, yeah. <laughs> it's like I'm I gotta here. make sure it doesn't start targeting me. Oh, I hit it by accident. It's, it's over. Uh oh! Get out of there! Get out of there! Yuri, what are you doing? I'm run trying. away! Try. <laughs> now, is that is that red monster always gonna come at that time, or was this totally a dynamic situation? You you. Uh, you got it right. It's totally dynamic uh, situation here. The oh, hello. these monsters will just roam the area. This oh, guy and now, in particular. Now our hunted monster yeah, is trying look, to look get out of here now. Yep. Interesting. Now is he going to be able to recuperate during the time that you're not engaging with him, or do you have a little bit of breathing room to, to I, retrack him? It's in my best interest to get to him <laughs> as fast as possible, fast, okay. so he doesn't recuperate. Okay. But uh, I wanted to get a card from this tail here, so this will be give us an extra. Uh, material part that we can then use um, for our crafting. So well, I don't know if uh, Mr. Red here yeah. is going to let you do that, but we're going to try. Oh. oh, go Tango! Yeah. You can do this. <laughs> Nailed it. Get it. Yeah. So Tango taking one for the team. <laughs> You're just like Tango. <laughs> you you got this, little bud. He's got Great. it. Great. <laughs> he'll, he'll come I'm join gonna me head in a, out. a little bit. Yeah. If you could wrap up here, just text me when you're done. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and we're seeing uh, broken parts. Is that so? Yeah. The oh no, that's that's just him. That's, oh, that's him. That's <laughs> him. He's he's I asleep right now. Oh, uh, little baby. Oh, poor little baby. Little uh, time lady. to finish the fight. <laughs> <laughs> Before we engage, I'm gonna resharpen my weapon. Oh, oh my interesting. Gosh, so awesome. Yeah. 
So then uh, we can go right in. Yeah. Wake up. We can just. A rude awakening, they say. His face looks so different now without the little spikes on it. Little spikes? Little spiky just face. Little yeah. spike here and there. Yep. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't have those horns like mm -hmm. attached to his side anymore. Uh, those are from Anata Monster anyway, so uh, he won't need it. Now, Yuri, do you, does, does this monster have a traditional health bar, or do you have to use visual cues to tell how far you're going? Uh, the visual in the cues fight? Okay. will be your primary. Oh, uh, please oh. watch your health, Yuri. Yes, I am. This is your friendly neighborhood reminder to <laughs> heal. Tango, please. Tango's Tango, do it. A, yeah, yeah Tango, is. what's up? Best cat on the planet. <laughs> Tango, Tango. <laughs> Tango. <laughs> Tango is doing good work. Putting in those hours, putting in that OT. <laughs> yeah, so you have to look for visual cues. Sleeping was one of uh, uh, a yeah. very particular one. Just a monster that's asleep is trying to Re recover. recover yeah. 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 Got it. So. Uh, there you go. But yeah, monsters eventually will wear themselves out uh, with. You know, just by doing repeated attacks. Oh my goodness. And uh, we'll be. He tired. can burrow underground. How much stuff can this <laughs> monster do? So you'll see in a second why he's burrowing. <gasps> to get oh. new armor. Oh, get more wow. bones. That yeah. feisty fiend. <laughs> yeah. So now my attacks. So he regained his armor. Like, so I'm now you gotta back at, start like, back up. Chipping away from at his back once again. But he doesn't ha He didn't get his tail back. <laughs> okay, good. Uh, Cannot regrow that's his tail. Ours now. <laughs> <laughs> Your tail belongs to, to us. Me. Or me. <laughs> Both of us. We'll share. <laughs> we'll share. We'll totally share. Go, Tango! I'm going to start the Tango fan club. Oh, man. Oh! Oh, oh, wow. Wow. Yeah, the delayed attack on that. <laughs> oh, that was awesome, though. I love, though, that he, he has to use his environment to to heal himself. Uh, if, if he hadn't gotten back to that spot, he wouldn't be able to that, armor Yes, up. that's correct. He cannot burrow in... Just uh, any old place. Yeah, just any area. Uh, so, But so you, you as the player, you can also interact with uh, environmental yes. things. Yes. I was trying to use a uh, set of vine traps that I saw earlier, mm -hmm. but uh, fortunately the Radabon was not. Oh, God, you're your health. Try it. Uh-oh, 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 I'm dizzy. Uh-oh, 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 is this it? Is I'm this dizzy. the end? I'm dizzy, Is no. this the end? Okay, No, nope, we're good. <laughs> we're good. Tango's like, come here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's oh, a surprise <laughs> And we are back. Round two. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Round two commenced. Yeah. Uh, all Yuri actually didn't have to go far to retrack <laughs> our monster. Yeah, it, it's the same <laughs> quest. So, uh, yeah, he was... He, you know, if you fast enough, he just he'll thinks stay like, in the same oh, area. finally, that guy is gone. <laughs> <laughs> I'm back. So I'm back, baby. Normal quest rules say it's uh, three faints, so you can faint up to three times. I see. Uh, but you know, third time and you're out. Oh, that's what got me last time. Not again, Radabon. Not this time, monster friend. Oh. Not so friend. <laughs> I could. Ma I'm gonna just pay more attention to Tango now because I've been watching the Hunter most of the time, but Tango really is the star of the show. <laughs> let's be honest. <laughs> so, and Palicos have fully customizable armor as well. Yes. What? Uh, oh, <gasps> and right now. What's he's, happening? He's uh, the real MVP here. He's getting the oh getting a little oh. cart that he can shoot from. Oh my oh god! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> this is the cutest thing. I like how there's giant towering bone monsters and also little kitty catapults. Or a arrow. You know, it's a whole world, right? No, it is a whole world. It's a whole world. Kristen, you are correct. It is a whole world. It's a Monster Hunter world available January 26th on <laughs> PS4. <laughs> oh, there it is. Oh. oh. Done. Monster defeated. Amazing. Congratulations, Yuri. Yeah, thank you. So you beat the uh, game. That was it. <laughs> it was just that one fight. No. no. <laughs> All right, so no. now we get to we get to carve up. Get to carve up some materials uh, and then bring these back to our blacksmith back to camp. And then, you know, you can make new weapons and armor out of this guy. So, um, 
yeah, a couple of things to note. I mean, you you'll get armor, you get uh, abilities, uh, or you know, passive skills with the different armor sets. With different armor sets, and they were designed to resemble, or at least uh, hark back to the monster that you you just hunted. Mm. So, or wh where they came from, right? So this guy, armored parts that are harder to break. So. Uh, we'll see in the armored skills Ooh. some uh, some some of that reflected there. Yeah, that I'm excited to see what it looks like. Yeah, that sleeping gas was also a. Ooh. <laughs> <big factor. laughs> what? I, I, work. I'm just tuckered out. <laughs> and it, I, I, we should note for people watching, obviously, you know, players will get some supplies. They might not get everything they need on the first run, so mm. they might have to hunt an, another monster to complete. Yeah. But we want to go back and just show the crafting process, right? Right. So, yeah, despite that uh, one faint, I have hunted this guy before. <laughs> uh, Maybe. I've, I've collected a couple of parts here, so uh, we should be able to craft. So here we are at the smithy with, I love all the stuff just rolling just by rolling on the conveyor <laughs> belt. Uh, so, are you ready so to craft? <laughs> yeah. Uh, we've, it looks like we've got enough, uh, enough parts to make some Radabon armor uh, and uh, a couple of other things. So... So this is the armor that you were wearing under the the samurai skin. Yes, that was yeah, that was armor from another monster. <laughs> yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they're so pumped. They're so into this. Yeah. We're oh pumped to get gosh. the gear. They're pumped to make it. So. Oh, very cool. Uh, Ooh. Yeah, we're gonna start equipping it uh, one at a time. Uh, oh we'll see. my yeah. <laughs> goodness! Yes. Oh my god. Yes. <laughs> Put all this armor oh on. Oh my goodness. Yep. Uh, so, already taking on the appearance of the monster we just hunted. Yeah, you can already... Oh, yeah. my goodness. Dude, this is amazing. <laughs> Man, they're quick. <laughs> it's full, full service. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. And, uh, and if we look over at the, the skills, these are the passive skills that we have uh, here from that uh, armor. So, from the whole, the whole armor set here, we got each individual armor piece each one giving one point towards a skill. So sleep resistance, that'll come in handy if I have to right. hunt this guy again. Right, because right. he used that sleeping gas on you the one yeah. time. So bleeding resistance, another element in the game, sleep attack. So if I have a weapon that does sleep attack, this will enhance that attack. Uh, slugger will improve my ability to knock monsters out uh, with like blunt attacks. And a guard, of course, you know, all going back to that armor, those armored parts that he had, uh, this will enhance my, my ability to block um, now, you guys were a big fan of Tango, right? Yes. Yeah. Uh, a little bit, maybe. Yeah. Oh, he's so cute. Let's see what we can make. Oh, my oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Yes. Going to get a little weapon, too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Tango deserves it. Deserves <laughs> 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 it, too. too. Yeah. Oh, oh my God. That's yes. going to be his little, little weapon now. Tango oh. is just the best. Oh. All right. Now let's let's see his armor. Oh my gosh, dude, this is the best. I don't I don't know if we're ready for this. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know either. Oh, oh, are you kidding me? Yes. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> yes. You guys match. Yep. Oh, oh my, my good god. gravy. This you is the best yep. thing I've ever seen in my life. I can't life. wait to play this game. <laughs> <laughs> I just love it. I love the detail and. Y'all are just ready to go. <laughs> yeah, this is this is the best. Yuri, yeah. you just made my day, maybe <laughs> my week. And I'm gonna make some uh, some weapons too. Let's see here. Right, because there are, there are 14 different kind of weapons that you can make in this game. Yeah, uh, 14 different weapon types. Uh, but yeah, each of them, you know, is gonna have a lot of variation there. So oh I just God. made the bone spike. <laughs> that's from the uh, the Radabon. Right. Uh, and it actually has right there on the on the top right. You see, it's gonna have sleep attack. Oh, uh, nice. nice. Yeah. And then uh, another one here it's, it's has a little more of his features you see there. Yeah. The, uh, Very detailed. This wow. is a heavy bow gun. And, uh, yeah, this one's got, um, yeah, it's going to have, wow. again, the different ammo types that will, you know, yeah. be reflective of that monster. Uh and will help you for future monsters to come. Yeah, the <laughs> other <laughs> monsters will be weaker against you know sleep. Already attacks. ready to get back yeah. out there. <laughs> so let me back out there. Well, very cool. It's a it's a really elegant system. Yeah, and then you can go in and uh, upgrade that armor that we just made. But uh, yeah, just a 
another close up here on your on your favorite. Uh, oh my gosh! <laughs> just just let me let me die here happily. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. Uh, and that's the the loop of the game. Very you know, cool. you go out and you hunt monsters. The more you hunt, the the better you get at uh, identifying patterns that the monster might have. Uh, but you know. Depending on the weapon that you use, if you're up close, the monster's going to do certain attacks. If you're far away, they might do something different. So if you want to really change up your play style, not only from the weapons that you use, you'll end up changing the monster's behavior toward, like, reacting towards you as well. So, right. Awesome. Uh, so awesome. There's, there's a lot of incentive to go back and, and hunt monsters again and again and help other players online or just, uh, you know... Just for the, the, story the joy of the game, the joy yeah. of the hunt, the joy of the hunt, making cat armor. <laughs> yes, this is the best. Uh, Yuri, thank you so yeah, much for joining much. us today. Yeah, thank you for having me. Uh, Kristen, thank you. Of and course. Monster Hunter World out, as I may have mentioned in this episode, <laughs> <laughs> January 26th for PS4. Uh, thanks for joining us, and we'll see you next time on PlayStation Underground. PlayStation.